Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to help you determine the Lewis structure for Br2 which is known as bromine gas or a dibromine. So it's a very simple structure, you just need to know the total number of valence electrons and then you can uh, determine its Lewis structure. As it is a diatomic molecule, the valence electrons will be same for these atoms. So each bromine atom has 7 valence electrons in its outer shell and hence there will be 14 valence electrons in total for this molecule. So now that we know the valence electrons, we can place both these atoms next to each other and start placing electrons to see if they can have complete octets. So I am going to place a pair of electrons between both these atoms to show a bond. Doing that we will be using up 2 out of 14 and we are left with 12 valence electrons. So I am going to place 6 electrons out of 12 for uh, around this bromine atom and the rest 6 will be arranged around this bromine atom. Doing that we will have, we will use up all the 14 valence electrons that we have and this will result in a Lewis structure like this. As you can see that each bromine atom has uh, 8 valence electrons after sharing this electro, after sharing one bond it has a complete octet structure so both these bromine atoms have complete octet and this is the lowest structure for br2 in which has a single bond between two bromine atoms and both these atoms have a complete octet i hope this video helps you to understand that and for more such videos on lowest structure molecular geometry polarity of the molecules make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching